Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Inside A Gamer. Welcome back to Planet Zoo, episode number six of our Spring Falls Cove Zoo. Now, off camera, so in the last episode, we started building this little uh, lima hut, which I wanted people just to, uh, you know, jump across, uh, be able to walk through, etc. I thought it would be nice. So off camera, I just put in all the rocks, because it's going to take a lot of time to do some of the rocks. It needs a bit of tidying up. Uh, some of the rocks are a bit too big. Um, so what I want to do is finish this build today. So what I've done, I do have one ring-tailed llama somewhere he was in here um he was posing for pictures here he is and basically if we just look at the habitat quickly he cannot get out but now it's saying he can earlier on it said he couldn't so we'll see how that moves in a minute uh so basically i want to make this as best as i can for him so i'm just going to come out of this zone it was all fine earlier so i'm very surprised that he can escape um interesting okay so he likes africa and tropical and that's what i'm going to be looking for here in the nature uh, we're going to go to filters okay so the biome he likes is tropical and the continent is africa there we go so we're going to put in a couple of trees and stuff for him that's the idea how big is this tree jesus christ that is a big tree nice tree though i mean is that too big does it look a bit odd i don't know maybe let's keep going what other trees do we have oh yeah that's better that's quite cool Okay, yeah, you know what? I want Because I wanted to put a tree in this little island. That's the idea for there. Because I want him to jump across that. Uh, what else do we actually have? What is this? Mangrove apple? Okay. We can work with this. Um, put something like around there. This is like a little viewing area, kind of. Um, that's the idea. Okay, what else have we got? We've got a sausage tree. What, what the hell is a sausage tree? I've never seen a sausage tree before. There we go. This is a sausage tree. Oh, tamarind. Yeah, they'll probably like a bit of tamarind. Uh, no, he can probably escape off that, though. That's the only problem with that. Maybe a small little tamarind tree here for him. Yeah, he'll like that. Water banana plants. Get a couple of these, especially as we kind of come in. I wouldn't mind putting uh, some trees and bushes in here as well for them doesn't have to be just uh, on the outside I want here to look in good as well we will move and tidy up this stuff um, as well I'm just placing it down to start with okay that's not really oh, oh, a willow no okay I need some sort of bushes that's kind of what I'm after now that bush is mental big yeah it's kind of cool I quite like that Couple of fern trees, maybe. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that all looks quite nice in here. We can uh, definitely sort out some other bits and pieces. Get a couple of these actually on, on the outside of this, and maybe down here as well. I quite like these. Okay, so he needs plenty of coverage. That's one thing we can do. And I'm going to build him kind of like a raft across here as well. That's the idea. So this series has been quite slow and it will be quite slow. It's going to be a long series. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to be doing like any fast forward stuff. You're going to have to watch all of me, unfortunately. I know it's not always the best. I do get quite quiet, uh, mainly because I'm trying to work out what the hell I'm doing, uh, which isn't always easy. Uh, and like I said, I'm not like an expert builder or anything like that. I, I play for a bit of fun. And that's all this is. Just a nice little bit of fun. Get a couple of these in here, maybe even. Oh, our lima. And he should be able to climb on a lot of this stuff as well. Bird's nest. There we go. Just want to make it nice for him. That is hanging in the air. That's not going to do me any good. And like I have said, we probably will tidy up bits. I might do a little bit off camera. I just want to kind of get the basics down. Uh, that's the general idea here. But just want to kind of make it look real nice for them as well. 
best we can. I want it to be kind of like a nice little open walkway, tropical kind of feel to it. That's the, the basic idea. So we'll get some of this stuff around here. What else have we got? Anything different? We've got some smaller stuff. This is, like I said, that kind of viewing gallery area. Just give it uh, some different bits and pieces. We've got some lotus flowers. We're going to have to bring that up. Okay, I think that's okay where it is. Got some of this sentry stuff, nice. I said the main thing is we're just trying to build up some foliage. That's the main thing here. Doesn't have to be neat, doesn't have to be tidy. Sometimes it actually looks a little bit better when it's a bit more scatty, in my opinion. Okay, so what else we got? What else can we use? Some of these mangrove trees. I think that's quite cool, the roots. Going into the water there. Oh, yeah, that's pretty nice. Rhubarb. I think it's a bit too big. Little bits around, I think, is okay. I haven't decided if I'm going to put some rock work uh, on the edge of the island yet either. That is something still to to be worked out, I suppose. But I think it's definitely looking okay at the moment. Get some more of this giant rhubarb down there. There we go, that's nice. Definitely could do with a little bit more of this kind of stuff around. Might actually look quite nice down here. Is that what we've already got? Might something a little bit different, make it look a bit more tropical feeling to it, I suppose. Like I said, some of these might have to be lowered down for the view and stuff. Uh, so we will we will look at it. What we got here? Just vines. Um. Hmm. Not the trees. Not so much on the old bush front, is there? Okay, we've got some more of this stuff. Maybe we'll go for that smaller one. I assume they like just playing in it. I mean, we could get a couple of rocks, maybe. What we'll do, we'll just lower that down a little bit. Get some different colored rock here. Just to break it up maybe a little bit. A big rock in here. And I still need to build them something to get across to that island as well. I want to put in like a, a pole or some sort. I think that's the plan. Uh, still needs a bit more foliage though, doesn't it? Okay, let's get some more of this stuff then. Um, mix it up just a little bit. And the main reason for that is that I don't want them to walk past that point. Even though the monkeys can, I don't want them to do that. So, just going to continue building it up. 
And I quite like this tree, but it's a little bit too big for me. Um, what else can we put in? We need something more down here. We've done the rhubarb. looking in here as well so their main nesting is up the top there but definitely want to try and throw in some more bits and pieces for them okay so far I think we're looking okay um, maybe we can throw in some of this stuff over here break this up a little bit okay Lemurs. Okay, that's what we're looking for here. I want to look at the lima, 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 llama. Okay, ring-tailed lima. This is what I want. Okay, so just want to build them some climbing stuff. That's the main idea here. So if I put that in, what I want to do is I'm going to swing that round that way, hopefully. And then I'm hoping that right, that's a two-meter log. That's not going to do it. Six meter log. Might be just enough here for what I'm looking for. Okay. What way around is what here? Is the blue going that way? Yeah. I mean, that's tight. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to move that back and I'm going to move it up. And then I just want to move it down a little bit more or maybe up a little bit there we go like that then I'm gonna press Control X it's gonna duplicate and then I'm gonna bring that across like that there we go so they do have another way to get over here they can climb up these things um, maybe we can put a little bit of bedding down for them over here just I mean it's not great but they might just want to sleep on the island in a bit of peace uh, what else are they going to want? They're going to want some enrichment, aren't they? Really? Is this all the stuff that they like? Alright, I'm going to try to rub it up over here. We'll give them a small ball. Give them another colourful ball over here. This can be their kind of like little bit of peace. Bite fruit trees. Definitely want to get a couple of these put in. that hey these guys should have plenty of enrichment I'm surprised that the ringtail llama likes all this stuff to be honest with you but what do I know okay so I am gonna throw this round the back here you know be a good place for it if we just turn it round there you go they can get a drink from here and now they need something for food What do you want for food, my friends? Water troughs. Well, what the hell are you going to eat? Oh, feeding platforms. If I put a feeding platform here, these are the smallest ones. You're obstructed. Let's put another one. Put another one over here. A couple more climbable logs just to give them something to keep doing. Okay, if we go back into our nature, definitely need to put something over here.
We're gonna move you up. Right. Let's press play. Let's see what happens here. I think I've only got one ringtail llama, by the way. Oh no, we got a girl here. She's been moved. That's another boy. I suppose another boy won't hurt, would it? Okay. Uh, one more thing. I forgot. I haven't put a member of staff on here either. We're going to our zoo. We're going to our work zone. Yeah, I think we need a new work zone here. So if we get a new... Oh. Okay, we've done some research on the spiders. That's okay. Go back here. Let's get somebody doing the lima now. For the minute. Flamingos are doing quite well. Back to my zoo. Staff... Okay, let's hire a new keeper. For the minute. Yeah, okay. Uh, and now we need to make a new work zone. So, a new work zone. And they can also help look after them when they're not that busy. Okay, I think that's absolutely fine. Uh, this is going to be work zone 4. We go back then. Work zone 4 is going to be the ringtails and flamingos. There we go. Okay, so if we go into here, we can see that uh, you have no work zone, so we want to put you in ringtails and flamingos. Also, we want to put one of you guys who doesn't have a work zone. I'm going to put you in ringtails and flamingos as well. Security. I just brought one security guard. He kind of... Is that all we got? One? Uh, I'm going to put him in that area at the moment too. These, these guys, I'm also going to put one of these in the ringtails uh, for the minute. The other guy can kind of float. Vendors are okay. They're just doing what they need to do. Okay. We press play. Let's see if my ringtails escape. They shouldn't do. I have put elephant grass underneath. Sometimes they escape. Sometimes they don't. It's a bit of a funny one. Uh, animal trading. Did our, Are they on the move or what? Well, what's the story here? That Liam looks very stressed. Aaron, what the hell? Okay. Basically, they just need some food. Uh, I need some girls. I really need some girls. I think one is on the way though, isn't it? Oh, I had a girl. Okay, must just be me. So let's go to species. I want to get some ringtails if we can. Let's get rid of the otters. So yeah, we do have the new DLC, by the way. Uh, thank you to Frontier for sending us a key for that. So yeah, the next thing that I want to build is definitely something to do with them. Uh, okay, let's see if we can get some ringtailed. We can get some red ones maybe even. Let's just reset all species. Oh, I want some lemurs. Confirm. There we go. I think they can live together, right? I don't think there's an issue with these two living together. You know what? How about in the species we just put the normal ones in first? But I am fairly certain that they can live together. Oh, these want them. 
Boys, boys, boys. Can I buy any girls? Okay, we're going to adopt you. Clearly don't have enough for you. Go into our next page. Don't have enough for any of these girls. Wow. Okay, I can get you. I can buy you, though. And I can get you. Okay, I've adopted a few here now. So if I go to the animal trading... Okay, so they all should be coming in here now, right? Okay, so the zoo looks pretty barren. This is a new area. The flamingos can need a bit of work still. Uh, damn it. It's so weird that this is what it does. Because it was absolutely fine the other day. I can't even click on him. <laughs> he's uh he's playing playing sleepy sleeps okay where's all my ringtails where's all my ringtails come on bring this one back for me at least naughty naughty ringtail okay i'm gonna pause the game for a second that's that good yeah he has social issues i know that uh, it's really strange because this was set so he couldn't escape but clearly uh, this is not doing what it's supposed to be doing anymore interesting maybe the game didn't save after I fixed it I mean can he escape from that now I mean, we'll have to find out in a second. Let's click him again. I mean, it looks a bit stupid right now, but right now I just want him to stay in there and then I'll fix it properly. Yeah, really weird. Uh, I had it so they couldn't escape when I last saved it. I'm going to have to just see how this kind of refreshes itself now in a second. We do have some more lemurs coming in now. He might not want to escape as much. Look, you now have a girlfriend. Hey. She can't escape. I don't know why the vet can't reach here. This I'm going to fix off camera. But there we go. There is our next one. So the lemurs are, are half set up. All I really need to do with them now is uh, fix the barrier with the elephant grass. And hopefully they don't all escape on me again. But they seem happy. There's three girls and two boys and hopefully we'll make some babies. And There's not a lot of food available. Why are you not feeding these poor bloody things? This area is still a bit barren. So like everything, like even the flamingos, we are going to go backwards and forwards. I might actually put more water in here for the flamingos. Um, I, that's what I thought about the other day. So we'll put more water in here. That is the plan. Flamingos are going. We've got the ringtail llamas. Um, we got the tortoise. we got the uh, meerkats. They're all doing okay. We've got our spiders. So the next episode... So the plan for the next two episodes. So the next episode, we're going to put in an American animal. And then... The episode after that, we're going to build our staff buildings and make this a little bit nicer. And I want to fill out these areas with benches and little kind of coffee tables and stuff like that. That is our plan. Okay, just where are my lemurs? How are we doing in here now? How are we doing? Are you all in here? Are you all hiding? Oh, they're looking at something. I'm not sure what they're looking at. Now here's one. Just wandering through the grass here. Look. Oh, 
Ah, got to get a picture of him and he buggers off. Now this is the problem with all these people. But... The main thing is hopefully he's a little bit happier. I wanted to do a bit of climbing. Got his mate following. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's cute. That's the picture we want. No, <laughs> I missed it. Okay. Anyways, they look happy enough. They're socially not happy. Oh, they want somewhere to hide. Well, that's why I put the thing up high for them. I was hoping they're going to climb up all this, but it doesn't seem to be what they want to do. So I might have to make them a little cave. I thought they'd cope a little bit better than they have done, in fact. That's not great. Not great. But money is good. The zoo is looking okay, right? And uh, yeah, we're going to leave it there for today's episode. So in the next episode, what animal shall we look at? I want to look at one of the new American animals. Thinking the beavers. Oh, we could do the American alligators. Or the bison. The bison might be pretty cool. Um... Yeah, part of me kind of wanted to do the giant otters. We'll have to have a look. We'll have a look for the next episode. I'm not sure what animal we're going to do. We just need somewhere for them to hide, really. And, okay. That's fine. We'll sort that out. I'll just build them something very small here just so they can hide if they wish to. So if you are enjoying this content, please do subscribe down below to the channel. Hit the bell icon for notifications. I upload nearly every single day. Other than that, myself, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you at the next one. Bye for now.